I was introduced to Columbia by an assistant coach in high school. Uh, he had on some shorts one day in practice. Off of first glimpse, I thought it was North Carolina. I started talking to my coach, I said, well, it was uh, Columbia. And he said, oh, it's a great academic school. I said, yeah, and you play football up there? He said, yeah, that didn't go so well. And for some reason, that intrigued me, like, huh, they're great in academics, but you didn't enjoy the e athletic experience as much. I just started to respect the experience that I could have in totality, academic and athletic, and um, I made a commitment to come to Columbia. I remember sitting there in the lunchroom one day with uh, my teammates, and we're watching Florida State, and guys had their mouths wide open in awe. And I'm like, I'm not in awe of those guys, because those guys are D1 football players, and we're D1 football players. When you have success, uh, especially in New York City, the NFL takes notice, and I was blessed to have every single head coach and many scouts come through the Columbia football program. But, uh, my father always told me to run a marathon, it only takes one step at a time. So uh, I knew there was 26.2 miles in front of me going from Columbia to the NFL, but I just took it day by day, really took it step by step. And I think a collection of guys started to have that same spirit, that same attitude, and took the challenge. Yeah. Baby, everybody did their job. Yeah. One, two, 